At least two people were killed and hundreds injured during riots in the Pacific territory of New Caledonia. The riots that started on Monday are in response to French Parliament's decision to give French residents their more voting rights. Rioters have been reportedly torching cars, setting buildings alight and attacking police stations. There have also been reports of several exchanges of fire between rioters and civil defense groups in capital Noumea. The riots forced French President Emmanuel Macron to cancel a trip to chair an emergency defense and national security meeting on Wednesday, the president's office said. This is the worst unrest the island has seen since the 1980s. Located between Australia and Fiji, New Caledonia has been a French territory since the 19th century. The violence started after lawmakers in Paris voted 351 to 153 to grant French citizens who have lived in New Caledonia for at least 10 years the right to vote in provincial elections. They argued this was democratically fair. French authorities imposed a nighttime curfew and ban on public gatherings on Tuesday in response to the ongoing riots. However, France's High Commission of the Republic in New Caledonia on Wednesday said that serious disturbances were continuing and there had been an attempted prison breakout. The French interior minister said that hundreds of people, including police officers, were injured in the unrest.